Hey guys, it's Ajay here, aka Waltzing Wizard, and today it's going to be a pretty uh, short video. Um, I am going to be playing some free-for-alls on Jacious, but that's not going to be the focus of the video. I'm just going to be doing that for something for you guys to look at. I'm not going to be like trying too hard. I mostly just wanted to give an update on what's going on with my channel, why I haven't been posting so much recently, uh, what I'm planning on doing for future videos, and stuff like that. Um, Okay, so I guess first of all, what have I been doing lately? Uh, so, as you guys know, I was in India for a while. Uh, when I came back, I made one video, but then stopped posting again. Um, so what happened was TTO5 was going on. Um, that's uh, Tetris Tournament Online. It's the big tournament that was organized by Blink and the rest of the Hard Drop team. And uh, I actually got pretty involved with helping to... Uh, to uh, sort of be an admin for that tournament and I did a lot of commentating on some of the matches there um, and so that was taking up a decent amount of the time that I was taking with Tetris. Um, it was really good, I re definitely recommend that you guys uh, go watch those videos but that's why I haven't been posting as much recently, that's one of the reasons anyway. Um, so I'm not going to talk too much about that because I don't want to spoil the results if anyone's like watching the VODs or anything, but uh, if you guys want to watch my commentary, I, I'd i say the highlights, uh, my favorite matches that I commentated were definitely the All-Star match that happened after the Grand Finals, which was like a 3v3 between some of the best players of all time, as well as um, I really liked the Squirtle versus Eitsu match. I thought that was pretty instructive on how uh, four wides work. So unfortunately I won't be posting much after this video for the next week because uh, as soon as I'm done with this video I'm actually going to be leaving for Utah. Um, I, have a, I have a dance competition there and so I'm going to be there the whole week and I'm probably not going to get a chance to record. I am bringing my laptop but uh, obviously the focus needs to be on the competition not on playing Tetris. So probably not going to be doing too much while I'm there. Um, but once I come back, um, I'm definitely going to start uploading more. Um, the kinds of things I'm going to be uploading is going to shift less towards these sorts of uh, self-commentated games, and it's going to be more um, analysis and tutorial type things, because since CTTO just ended, I thought there were a lot of really good matches that happened during the tournament, and so I really want to uh, use some of them for analysis. and. I think the analysis videos are probably, or the one analysis video I've done so far is one of my most popular videos, so I think that's in high demand and it's something I should probably do more, so I'll be definitely be doing more of that. Um, perfect clears were very popular during the tournament, and um, I know this is sort of like a spoiler, but there were like several games where Jamba managed to get three perfect clears right out of the opening and so I'm sure that's a hot topic and a lot of people might be inspired to do that as well so as far as tutorials that's gonna be coming up and yeah that should be it um, so th another reason why I haven't been posting as much, sorry I'm kinda bouncing back and forth between topics here but um how do I spin this? Oh man I messed that one up anyway um, so another reason I haven't been posting as much is because uh, as many of you guys know Puyo Puyo Tetris was recently uh, release and I've been playing some of that. I do want to make videos regarding that but I think I have to change my recording settings because it, it lags a lot right now when I try to record. Um, so I probably just have to lower lower my quality settings or something. It's a little bit more RAM intensive than something like Jstress obviously. And so that's why I haven't been recording that. But I definitely want to make some videos for Puyo Puyo Tetris at some point just because I don't know, I think it's a pretty fun game. I think uh, it'll end up being really popular in the future. And so I definitely want to make videos uh, with more than just Jaystress because not many that people play Jaystress that much even. Um, so that's another thing to look forward to and another reason why I haven't been uploading as much. Uh, I think that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about. Uh, so yeah, once again, this is a pretty short video, but... Uh, just wanted to update you guys. I'll probably... I don't know, I'll play one or two more games, I guess. Maybe I'll self-commentate a little more. But not really the purpose of this video, so I'll probably be done in a sec here. Let's see, what's going on in this game? I haven't been paying attention. Looks like I'm dead, so <laughs> that's what's happening. Um, I don't really know any of these players. Um, 
or I don't know, slash play uh, is around a lot. I don't know who that is. Um, like I'm sure that's not his name on other Tetris things. This windy guy looks like a pretty fast player, if nothing else. Um, I don't know who Korwa is. I don't know who Simen is. I'll play one more game. Uh, yeah, if you have, has, have any requests, especially since Puyo Puyo Tetris just came out. Oh, one more thing I wanted to say. I've actually um, noticed a recent uptick in subscribers per day that I've been getting. Uh, so I appreciate the support. I'm not 100% sure why that's happening because I just haven't been uploading. Maybe like someone linked my videos somewhere or they got posted in some group but uh welcome to <laughs> those of you who this is the first video you're seeing since uh you've subscribed um yeah i hope you don't immediately unsubscribe when i don't post for the next week but uh, i promise it'll it'll come back next week and uh there's some good content coming for you guys we're just waiting for this next game to start and then uh we'll uh do one more game i'll play a little bit more seriously and then call it a day and I'll be off to Utah. My flight's actually in like four hours and I haven't backed yet. So I need to get on that. Shouldn't be playing Tetris right now. Looks like this is a pretty close match between uh, Windy U and Play. Play's a pretty good player, so the fact that Windy U's keeping it close and tells me that they're probably a pretty good player as well. Looks like uh, Windy has the cleaner field here and is gearing up to send some garbage, but Play has a pretty clean field himself. It seems like it's Seesaw, but since it's hurry-up garbage, it's dangerous for both of them. It could definitely end at any moment here. Uh, looks like Windy, that's, that might be it, yeah. Oh, okay, let's see. TKI opener, as usual. I found the TKI opener to be uh, really effective in Puyo Puyo Tetris. So far, I've run into mostly Puyo p players in my exploits on that game. I don't know if there's just more of them in general or if uh, it's considered better or something. I don't know. Or maybe there's just more at my elo. I haven't played that much, so like I'm pretty down there on the rankings. Oh, am I dead? This is not where I want to be. Somehow we're surviving. Let's try to down stack if possible. Normally I would have used that to cancel, but since it's not a 1v1, it's just more important to keep up the speed. Oops, I kind of messed up my finesse there. I think I'm going to have to practice more finesse because I make a lot of finesse errors and it's kind of fine in something like Jastrus to make a lot of finesse errors, but it's less fine in something like Puyo Tetris because speed is so limited in general that you want to be like placing your pieces as efficiently as possible. Oh my god, I was looking at not my screen, I was, <laughs> I was seeing how many players were left and then like lost track of where my piece was. Oh god, that was such a bad mistrap. Alright, well on that note, I guess uh, I'll end this video. Um, hopefully you guys answer that answered some questions of like where I've been lately, what I'm planning on doing, and uh, yeah, thanks for the support as always guys, and I'll talk to you guys in about a week. Uh, see ya!